Hi there, everyone. I'm meteorologist Ashley Baylor with a check of your latest forecast. As we continue through the evening and on into the overnight hours, we will have a few scattered clouds out there, and you can see a few showers will attempt to approach the region tomorrow morning. Not going to be overly successful, though. We will stay dry on Monday. We'll call it partly sunny because at times we will see more clouds and sunshine, but that will not hinder temperatures from warming close to 60 degrees. As we go from Monday night into Tuesday morning, may briefly see a little bit of clearing out there, but more clouds will fill in on Tuesday. So right now, Tuesday, we will be tracking mostly cloudy skies. As, as a cold front swings through the region. I'll have a chance for a couple isolated showers. It's not a great chance, but worth a mention nonetheless. 61 degrees in Edenton tomorrow. We'll top out at 62 degrees in Hatteras. Across the south side, partial sun. Our average high for this time of year is 50 degrees, but we'll be about 10 degrees above average with a high of 60 in Portsmouth, 62 in Virginia Beach, 62 degrees in Franklin. Across the peninsula, 58 expected in Hampton, 60 in Smithfield, points north of that and along the eastern shore, 53 at Cape Charles and 56 degrees in Gloucester. Here's a look at our seven-day forecast. So just a chance of a couple isolated showers on Tuesday. In advance of that front, winds will be out of the southwest, which will boost temperatures into the low 70s. Behind that front will cool down for Wednesday and Thursday, although Thursday, yet another cold front will swing through. This will be a relatively silent cold front in the sense it's not going to bring us much shower action. It's going to bring us a few clouds. But really behind that front is when we are going to be talking about cooler temperatures, down to 47 degrees for Friday and the final day of 2016.